We're at Skytop Lodge here in the northern part of Monroe County, and joining me is the general manager, Jeff Rudder. Jeff, great to have you here on the program. Thank you for having me. Jeff, we want to make sure everybody at home understands that the lodge is open to the general public, and they can come in and take advantage of things right here. Open to the public is a key phrase right there, George. Uh, yes, uh, actually, uh, Thanksgiving's upon us, and we're, in the, and we're in the throes now of decorating for the for Thanksgiving, and actually Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving, is a great arrival day for uh, many of our families and friends that come here on a regular basis. But I also encourage the local community to th consider and think about a little staycation, if you will, in terms of spending the night on Wednesday, because Wednesday is really when we have our campfire, and we have our s'mores, and we have our, uh, really, our kickoff to the holiday season. And with Thanksgiving, we do actually in our Windsor dining room have a buffet and I certainly encourage the local community to come up and consider Skytop as, as their either a continuation of tradition or certainly start a new tradition here at Skytop. Tell me about the gingerbread house that's in the lobby. Mm. Well that's become a tradition here at Skytop and actually uh, this year we have the facade of the hotel to include also the port share so it's an exact replica of the facade of, of Skytop Lodge. And it'll take about two weeks, a little less than two weeks to actually put together. And uh, so right before Thanksgiving, everybody will see the brand new constructed gingerbread house here at Skytop. Jeff, what, what would be the one thing that people come up here uh, for the holidays, what, what would be the one thing that you say that they should at least see or, or take advantage of? Well, for the holidays in general, Saturdays. And that's when Santa arrives. Every Saturday, starting from the Saturday after Thanksgiving. We have Santa's arrival, who takes place um, uh, around four o'clock, right at tea time. I mean, a long lasting tradition here at Skytop is tea and cookies at four o'clock. No matter where you are on the 5,500 acres, you will find your way back to Skytop for those tea and cookies. But Santa's arrival, we have carolers, and it's always good cheer and good fun, very festive, and puts you in the, in the spirit. And then once Santa arrives, um, he will sit down and take all the notes and all the lists from the kids. I would be remiss not to mention our Breakfast with Santa on every Sunday. And that to me is always fun for uh, the local community to take part in. There's a lot going on here at Skytop. Yes, yes. So if people want more information about what's happening here at Skytop, how would they get it? Skytop.com, most certainly. We have an events page on that particular website. We actually have a Broadway show coming here with Gilbert and Sullivan on the first weekend in, in uh, December, on the first Saturday. So there's many opportunities to get culture, to enjoy the, the natural beautiful surroundings, along with just having some good, good old-fashioned fun.